วัสดีค่ะก็นะคะวันนี้กับคลิปนี้นะคะก็แนะนําตัวเหมียวเองนะคะก็นะคะวันนี้พอมีเวลานิดนึงนะคะก็เลยอยากจะมาฝึกภาษาอังกฤษกันหน่อยนะคะแต่ว่าคือเดี๋ยวจะนําบทความเก่านะคะในครั้งของเพื่อนๆที่เราฝึกกันในกลุ่มนะคะมาอ่านเป็นบทความที่อ่านน่าจะไปสัก2อสรอบละเมื่อตอนที่เริ่มฝึกภาษาอังกฤษใหม่ๆนะคะทีนี้ตอนนี้เราก็รู้สึกว่าเราอยากจะเอามาฝึกใหม่นะคะแล้วก็เพื่อการที่จะไปเปรียบเทียบกับภาษาอังกฤษของเราเมื่อก่อนนะคะก็เดี๋ยวขอพูดภาษาอังกฤษเลยนะคะโอเคค่ะ Hello everyone how you doing today Okay I'm doing great Today is Monday so the time for some people or most people start working today right uh, But for me I'm not working uh, I almost work at my house What I'm doing during the day? During the day, um, I just uh, wake up, cooking, exercise, yeah, and practice English and Spanish is my new language. And yeah, and now in this video, I'm going to talk about not mean talk. I I'm going to practice my English skill by reading, and I would love to. Read the old article I have read before in our group. Okay, uh, in I mean in my English group, we we already have many friends from many country. Yeah, not really many country. Almost a Thai person, so, but we live many country in like uh, Thailand, America, German, Australia, Australia, or um, yeah, except me. In Uruguay, yeah. Okay, and in this article, I would like to read the old article I have read before because I would like to compare myself with my English now and with uh, before. How is it? Because this is the way I'm learning English. I like to practice and record video. So every time I will listen my voice, so ah uh, yeah something like that, and I listen from other friends, yeah like Thai friends or native speaker, many accent I like to learn. But for me, I try to be Thai accent, right? But I want to speak like native speaker. So that's it. What I'm going to talk? Okay, I think let's. Let's go. Okay, I will read. Uh, the article name: Brandy Brothers, ages eleven and nine, colleagues. Oh, uh, sorry. Uh, let me try again. Brandy Brothers, ages eleven and nine, colleagues. Next, most students in the United States begin college or university when they are eighteen or nineteen years old. But because Morgan and Alex plays were exceptionally precocious, they were ready to begin their university studies years ahead of others. Morgan was ready to start college at the age of eleven. His brother Alex, his brother Alex, was ready two years later. As Uh, also at age eleven, Morgan, whose strengths are both mathematical and verbal, could speak two languages before at one. His father spoke only English to him, and his mother, whose native language is Greek, spoke only Greek to him. He never mixed one with the other. His mother said. Morgan could talk before he could run, and by the time he was three, he was attending a Japanese kindergarten while his father David, a physics, oh sorry, a physics, um, I, uh, I, I don't sure, physics, physics, ah okay, a physics, was doing research in Japan. When Morgan returned home to Chicago, he thought his brother Alex Japanese. 
Both brothers could do complicated mathematical problems when they were five years old. When Morgan was nine, he scored in the top one percent of the nation's high school students in algebra and the top two percent in trigonometry. And Alex broke a nation record at the age of eight because he was the youngest child even ever to, uh, to score seven six seven hundred sixty in math on the set on the uh, on the set scholastic aptitude test oh, sorry uh, the average set math score for 12 grade students in 495 the brothers are also precocious in music Morgan could play the violin beautifully when he was five, and Alex could could play the piano when he was four. Both have won awards for their musical talents. A Morgan and August so smart that they never have to study. No, says Morgan. People think because I am gifted that I can do anything without a foot. But basically, I spend the whole evening doing homework or violin with half an hour for dinner. Okay, let me uh, advise myself. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I mean, I mean, uh, let me comment myself. I still have problem about collect, 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 collect. I G G uh, problem about G because when uh, when I say only the vocabularies by themselves like collect collect I think I'm I'm okay but when I'm read together my mind is not uh, along to to my mouth so I need maybe you think in this video I'm I'm read slow because I try to concentrate when I'm speaking and when I'm reading how my mouth and my mind, my brain, my, my head, my brain, right, going together. That's it. So I think in this video, I'm a little bit reading slow because I try to control my what, what I'm pronounced. Okay, and the other problems for me is uh, about, about, uh, uh, Mm, th i think yeah uh, sometimes you can concentrate uh, with your wrist slowly so you listen your mind your your, your sounds your voice in you, how i say it like a, when you're speaking you listen your voice together like uh i mean at the same time so that's it you will concentrate more but it's like just beginning to practice English right okay I don't know how to say but please advise me any words uh, if I still not uh, pronounce colleague and I will really appreciate that thank you